wanted to update all of my video descriptions. I didn't find a good tool online to do this like automatically. I just thought I would make my own. Oh my god. We're gonna do the first 10 uploads. Oh, oh. So when you execute it right here, that's gonna, that's yeah, gonna be it. It should do all my videos. All right, let's see it. Updated. Updated. <laughs> Got it on, like it, I'm a blow. All right, yo, uh, I'm moving out tomorrow. Well, actually, it's 3.10 in the morning. Look at all these batteries. Look, I have to put these in a box. Oh, it just feels so gross. Okay, what's good? Second year is done. I wasn't gonna do a tour, but like real quick. This is my desk, which used to be the bar. And uh, yo, my stepdad loves good speaker systems. So this is my bed. It's actually way comfier than it looks. I'm not gonna lie, right? You pull up a chair for the bar and then you just see battery. <laughs> this whole basement is just where I'm living for the next little while. You can see the projector up there. I'm going to convert my website into a Node.js project. I'm choosing Ubuntu, 32 CPUs, 1,000 dollars a month i'm gonna just get one cpu turns out that deploying a website is a whole job in itself you know what i mean learning some new stuff is basically what i'm saying now is when i actually get to convert my website here we go first time we got our server running 8080 whoa bro bro oh just paste it it's gonna break guarantee what? It downloaded. Just close all the tabs. The website's still super broke. Content. <laughs> That's some good content right there. As you can see by the title of the video, I'm going to make a... Uh, a YouTube API descriptions updater. I did that a few months ago and I did it in Java. I hard coded everything, everything is static. I'm gonna make a much more advanced uh, system right now. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Failed to look up pages. This is our pseudo code. If equals null. We wanna call what we just did here. Whoa. So it's counterintuitive because both of these actually have the same redirect links. Look, the first time you come here, you're gonna go into this if statement. You're gonna be asked to sign in. It's gonna redirect you back to itself. And then now it's gonna see that it has the auth code. So it's gonna go in here. This redirect URI, it doesn't even actually redirect, but it has to be the same as this one. <laughs> Google, what are you doing? It's so, it's so finicky to get it to work, you know what I mean? Not half bad. We're just gonna be like, you made it, boy. Redirect to YouTube app. Sign in with YouTube, and then it takes me to like the other page. Hey, you made it, boy. It still doesn't work, but it's a different error. Invalid credentials. Project is not found. Why isn't this enabled? <laughs> Related playlists, uploads, favorites, watch history. So now we're actually sending the upload playlist. What's gonna happen here? 400, so we got an error. No way. Oh look, I've wanted to make an LED music visualizer. <laughs> okay, so you can see that it's calling itself and then it crashes at the very end. Okay, watch what happens now. It's broken. <laughs> if this happens or this equals null, send uploads. Else redirect it recursively. Hey. So if you request more than 50 at a time, then it actually does it in parts. If you requested 100, it would probably take twice as long because it's got to do two requests. What's good? We're back. We're back, boys. Let's <laughs> create a table underneath the search bar, have it auto-populate, blah, blah, blah. We should access the URL and then make the image. Update table data. <laughs> oh my God just got all my videos shit you're gonna forget what site you're on are you on youtube right now like where am i bro i gotta implement the range of videos if uh we have hit the start flag then i can push everything 
Okay. Start. Oof. I was recursively calling the other function. Yeah, I think that's not supposed to be there. All right, let's get up the... Whoa. Oh my God, this shit actually worked. You would, you would change this and then you'd be like, and we built a door. And then it would do that. <laughs> okay, I think that means we have the searching done. I'm so sad to say that I could not, I couldn't do it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna split this video into two parts, but the biggest problem, oh my God. Every time a user signs onto the website, it overrides the token. So I need a way that I can store these credentials securely without them overlapping between each other. So I just started realizing like, oh my God, if I do this wrong, I could actually like mess up a lot of things. Like also, I really, 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 <laughs> I need to finish my battery discharging robot. I want to finish him so we get the batteries going. Bzz, bzz. I got to learn a whole bunch of things about security and blah, blah, blah. That's it. Uh, signing off. I'm really bad at signing off of videos because I can't stop talking. If you want to support me and you were looking into like a cloud computing platform, if you use my link, you get $10 off. It's so sick because it's made for developers. And I just been realizing like, oh my God, I can do so much with this. So